French Defense, Classical, Steinitz, Boleslavsky Variation, 7, a 6-8.QD2B5. Sudden a close game that was lost by a mistake. White really outplayed Black in that one. Both players had an amazing opening. White overpowered Black in the middle game. Sharp games are frequently the result of starting with the king's pawn since it dominates the center and frees up the bishop and queen on the light squares. While preparing for d5, the French defense prevents the light squared bishop in favor of a strong center and opportunities for counterattacks. The center is fully controlled by d4 and the dark squared bishop is made available. The e4 pawn is threatened by the center counterattack on d5. Nc3 defends the e4 pawn and pressures the d5 pawn. Nf6 defends the d5 pawn and also attacks the e4 pawn. e5 closes the center and immediately attacks the knight on f6. Nfd7 retreats the attack knight and prepares the c7 c5 pawn break. f4 supports the e5 pawn and prepares to develop the knight to f3 behind the f pawn. C5 attacks the d4 pawn and prepares to develop the knight to c6 behind the c pawn. Nf3 supports the d4 and e5 pawns. Nc6 develops the knight and attacks the d4 pawn. B3 develops the bishop and defends the d4 pawn. A6 takes control of the b5 square and prepares the b5 pawn push. Qd2 develops the queen, supports the bishop on e3 and prepares queenside castling. B5 takes space on the queen side, controls the c4 square and prepares to fianchetto the light squared bishop to b7. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. Backs off. This develops a bishop off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is the last book move. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. This wins material. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This ignores an opportunity to defend a knight that was under attack. It is a mistake. This is the only move that works. This threatens to win a knight. It is a great move. This poses a material threat. It is incorrect. This wins a bishop. This is the only good move. It is best. Recaptures. It is quite good. This forks multiple pieces. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This ignores a better way to evade the check from the opposing knight. It is a mistake. That bishop was open for business. It is ideal. By growing a queen from its beginning square, this activates the queen. It is ideal. A pawn that was being attacked and had no defenses is now protected by this. It is ideal. This reveals an attack on a knight. This threatens to win a knight. It is best. This requires an outpost, a square that is currently in play where a pawn cannot push the knight off. It is ideal. This poses a fork piece threat. It is incorrect. This develops a rook off its starting square, getting it into the action. This prevents the opponent from being able to fork pieces. It is excellent. This poses a fork piece threat. It is quite good. This exposes a bishop attack. It is ideal. This immobilizes the opponent's queen by pinning it to the king. It is best. That was a truly amazing move. This is the only good move. It is brilliant. Recaptures. That is good. That was a truly amazing move. It is brilliant. Backs off. It is quite good. That rook earns material if it is captured. It is ideal. This may succeed in winning a bishop. It is quite good. This creates an x-ray attack through two of the opponent's pieces. This stops the opponent from being able to win a bishop. It is best. This exposes an attack, threatening a queen. It is forced. This moves the queen to safety. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This avoids the queen's check. It is ideal. That rook was available for free. It is ideal. This allows a forced checkmate. 
This is the start of the end game and black is losing. It is a mistake. This forces an eventual checkmate. It is best. Sudden a close game that was lost by a mistake. White really outplayed black in that one. Both players had an amazing opening. White overpowered black in the middle game. 